We have landed on this island. Looks like there's three different islands in a group. We're paddling for five hours. The whole time I just felt uneasy and like I was being watched. So we jumped out early and that was just a, a reminder as to where we are and uh, our place in the food chain here. So very much won't be getting back in the water for the remainder of the trip. We're just a bit, it's just way too crocky. Top of the morning, some beautiful island in Cape York. About 10 miles off the mainland, low tide. Look at that stretch of reef. As we're walking along this reef ledge, flicking to see if we can get some lunch. Highly optimistic, playing a few tunes, flicking a few lures. There's good vibes all around here today at camp. Making our way to the tip of Cape York. How bloody good. Oh! Teriyaki fish wraps, baby. Beautiful little GT. Play him out of there. Keep him out, mate. Keep him out. Keep him out. Yes! <laughs> Woo! Oh, well done, man! Oh, he walloped it at your feet. Yeah, you did really well to keep him out of the rocks there, mate. Just heading back along this rock bar to camp after a quick flick this morning. Albert got a beautiful cod, Danger's got a fish, Rossi's got a fish. I'm gonna head back to camp now, get the drone up and do some drone snorkeling. Main reason why, two reasons. It's a very low tide right now, so I wanna check out just the extent of the reef and the bombies that are around us. But also, and this is a, it's a bit of a heed thy warning um, reminder, is I want to try and drone snorkel this croc that is on the other corner of this island where Gunzi and I pulled out from diving yesterday afternoon. So we arrived here and only had one small fish between five very, very hungry fellas. Post 30k with no wind paddle. So the hunger was real. Rudders up, 30k's paddling. Oh yes, the legs are free. Oh. And yeah, we dived yesterday afternoon and right where we got out, probably 10 minutes ago, Rossi said there was an eight footer, eight, nine footer just patrolling. So that's a, what's that? Two and a half meters, two and a half meter croc or so, which is a decent chunk of an apex predator. Yesterday afternoon, we only stayed in for probably 20 or 30 minutes, got a cray, got a trout, and the whole time I just felt uneasy and like I was being watched. So we jumped out early. And that was just a, a reminder as to where we are and uh, our place in the food chain here. So very much won't be getting back in the water for the remainder of the trip. We're just a bit, it's just way too crocky. Day 16 at sea, so far so good. No major injuries, vibes are high. Everyone's fitting into yeah. the calls of duty, camp life, surviving life out here in remote Cape York. He's going out for long haul, man. GT, gonna be teriyaki Cod, thank you, Albert. Beautiful, clean, white fillet. Here's the camp. Coals are burning. And a stellar day to match.
Can you talk us through what we got here prepped up for lunch, Rossi? Oh, mate, healthy wholemeal wrap. We got teriyaki, uh, what is it? Trevelli and cod. Got a little garnish from Albert there. The garnish, few spuds. Fried spuds. A couple of you? bush onions. <laughs> Black to briefy. Sun setting on another quality day here in far, far, far north Queensland. This is our one of our last tropical. Coral K style islands of the trip and definitely the last opportunity we'll have to spear even though we probably shouldn't have jumped in the water here evidently by Rossi seeing a croc this morning but uh, yeah the sun's setting on another day and leaves time for a bit of reflection a bit of gratitude for being out here living off the land and immersing ourselves in in nature some days are very tough and long and things break and you really got to dig deep to, to paddle up wind or or up current um, dealing with broken rudders and sails getting ripped and all that sort of stuff but at the end of the day it uh, it really it really is uh, an incredible experience the challenges the, uh, the incredible highs and the incredible lows and, and everything in between I'm gonna go out Try and have a bit of a flick. Right, grassy sweet lip, stripey, the valley. Damper, 